David Reimer, the tragedy of a boy who was experimented to grow up as a girl. He was treated with a false belief that he was raised as a girl, which affected his life, leading to his suicide. In 1965, a boy named David Reimer, or his birth name was Bruce Reimer, was born in Canada. He has a twin brother named Brian Reimer. Both brothers are in good health. But when he was eight months old, David started having urinary problems, known as phimosis, a narrowing of the foreskin. So his parents took him for a circumcision. Dr. Jean-Marie Hewitt, the doctor in charge at this time, instead of using the commonly practiced method, instead opted for electrocautery, which is not very popular, causing the results to not be as expected. David's genitals were burned by the heat and the damage caused is too much to be healed. His parents were worried that in the future he would not be happy living as a man without a penis. They try to figure out how to save David until they see a psychologist named John Money on television. John Money is recognized as one of the leading experts in gender research and expertise in gender-neutral children. David's parents wrote a letter to John, describing what had happened to his son, and took him to visit John in the United States. During that time, female genital mutilation was more studied and approved than penile reconstruction. Additionally, John claimed that David would be happiest if he lived as a woman with a working penis. Because of this, he pushed for a gender change over David, but that's not the only reason. John chose to recommend sex reassignment surgery because at the time he was studying the gender gate theory. John claims that parents can choose their child's gender and parenting methods, which will determine the child's gender identity for him to grow up. It wasn't something he was born with at all. He saw David's case as an opportunity for him to prove his theory. Therefore, he chose to continue following the boy's life. When David's parents agreed, the operation began in 1967, when David was just 22 months old. Since then, David was raised as a girl and changed his name to Brenda Reimer. David was given estrogen to give him a feminine appearance. His parents would bring him and Brian back to John every year to check on his behavior. John referred to David's case as John slash Joan and claimed that the transformation was successful. He claims that David's behavior is visibly girl-like and completely different from that of his twin Brian. When David and Brian are with John, he often lets the twins play sexual acts. These things started when they were only six years old. John had them do different poses and had them photographed at least once. Whenever they refused to comply, John would get angry. Both David and Brian share that John tends to be calm in front of their parents, but becomes short-tempered in the presence of the boys alone. At the age of 13, David began to experience depression and he threatened to kill himself if he saw John again. His parents eventually told David the truth about David's sexuality and his childhood sex reassignment surgery. When he was 14 years old, he underwent another sex reassignment operation. This time, he will live as a man and change his name to David. At the age of 25, David fell in love and married a woman named Jane, living together for 14 years, and he also adopted his wife's three children. He worked in a slaughterhouse and said in an interview that he enjoyed living as a man, but that happiness was not always with him. David was fired from his job. He sold the rights to a movie about his life, but the money was stolen by investors. As for Brian, after a period of treatment for schizophrenia, at the age of 36, he committed suicide from a drug overdose. This loss affected David greatly. David broke up with his wife and later returned to live with his parents. In 2004, David committed suicide at the age of 38. John Money never spoke of either David or Brian's death, but colleagues said he was deeply saddened and ashamed. 